Hello guys, welcome to Artesium and today I will draw um, a cube. Um, it might uh, seem like a simple concept, oh you're drawing a cube and, and that, but uh, we have to start from somewhere. You have to keep in mind that I'm only a student, I am not an official artist nor to have a career of an artist or anything um, that has got to do with artistry. Um, I am a student, I learn, uh, you know, I am currently learning a lot about, uh, you know, artistry and how it works and how to draw and I train myself every day to do it, so please keep that in mind. But um, getting back to the video, I'm going to show you how to draw a cube. So, the materials you need is um, quite, uh, quite simple actually, you just need paper and uh, you can have uh, one pencil. Um, but uh, personally, so if you want to get serious um, about art here, then I would prefer you to buy this Derwent Graphic 24, uh, which has from 9B to 9H. And let me explain you what that says. 9B, uh, B basically means a soft pencil, which means that if you put that on paper, basically a lot, well, a lot darker. But 9Hs are very, very light, or 9Hs, from 9B to 9H, and H is hard and B is soft. Just remember it that way, and don't worry, you won't get, um, you won't get mixed up by that. Um, yes, and that is what that is, but if you want to use a single pencil, that is fine. But if you do want to use a single pencil, keep in mind that if you want to make uh, shades... Uh, that are lighter and darker, you have to press on the pencil harder. If, if you want to make a shade that's very dark, you have to press on the pencil hard, and if you want to make a shade that's lighter, press it very lightly on the paper, and then you'll create that effect. Anyway, let's start off with the cube, okay? Uh, always what I do first is I illustrate, or in other words, sketch, basically, the object that I want to draw. The easy way to sketch a cube is just simple, just basically draw two squares, and just uh, what you do is you draw the two squares and then link the three corners there, like shown, together, like that. And that's how you can draw a cube, basically. Um, I'll draw a cube and uh, sketch a cube. And then after that, like you see, what you have to make, another decision you have to make, is you have to decide yourself where the light will go, because the important thing in, in artistry is to decide where the light is shown on that object. Light, light, creates all the difference of that object. If there will be no light, it's not going to be realistic. The, there's light everywhere. Even when you put it in a room that's very dark, it still has some light somewhere. What you do is, once you basically decide where the light will be shown on that cube, then you basically shade it like so. Using this pencil, um, a H pencil, um, onto this side uh, of the cube. Um, this pencil for the top of the cube later on. Uh, of, of, of course it depends how the light will shown on it. Like you see this light is going at an angle. If it will be just straight on that cube, uh, the shade, well the shades on either side should be the same pretty much. But since it's at an angle, then the, the top usually, the top usually is darker than the sides are usually when the light is shown. Um, and then later on, of course, the last one is going to be the softest pencil, basically, and it's going to be the back of the cube, since the light is shown on the other side, like you see through in, in the arrow, the um, shade is going to be at the back of the cube. Alright, so I guess you are happy right now that you've drawn that cube and you're actually thinking, oh my goodness, well it's a 3D cube, it looks nice. Nope, wait there, You, I haven't mentioned the most important thing in art. Shadows, what about them? You forgot about them? No, you have to add them in, you have to add the shadows in. So basically how we do shadow is because of the influence of light, what you have to do is you have to create the shadow like shown. I can't really explain you it much how to create shadows. Uh, however, what I can do is I can show it to you. So basically when remember when there's a cube or any object which has this form of uh, basically like a, a square, any object that has like a square face or whatever, then what you do is always usually shadows always come up with arrows like you see. It's like a big giant triangle kind of, it's like a 
pointer and that they see in like Google locations or something. Basically, you do that. And then, but start off with very light tones, obviously. Then what you do is gradually you build up into harder and uh, into darker and darker tones, basically, until you get this really really cool effect of the shadow, and it makes it very very realistic. Anyway, uh, guys, that's it. That's basically the brief uh, review of how to make a simple cube uh, and how to, um, you know, uh, draw uh, a quite realistic, not definitely photorealistic, but quite a realistic cube. Anyway, guys, hopefully uh, you enjoyed this video and hopefully it did help you with your further um, artistic drawing. Um, uh, comment down below. Uh, about the video, whether it's alright, what do you want me to do next? I'm really happy to um, get any suggestions from you guys. I'll be really, really happy about that. Um, and yes, and of course, subscribe if you want more of these videos, that would be helpful. Um, anyway, guys, hopefully, see you in another video um, uh, you know, of this channel called, called Artesium. And yeah, see you later, guys. Bye. Bye.